shown below are the two views of a cube phase p is opposite to 1 phase q is opposite to 2 r is opposite to 3 which option can be folded to make the cube so personally i find these type of questions a let a uh, little bit difficult uh, especially here when they give almost similar pattern like in every phase there is a line and dot so one way to do that is you draw it you will be given a rough paper you can draw it open it and draw it and then you can match but i will suggest ki first check out at all the corners and if you can do by that way then there will be no need to draw it so we know that every cube has eight corners these are the four corners and these are the remaining four corners these three faces are shown in this view and remaining three faces are here so these four and these four are different corners so total eight corners are we can see and if we check at each corner we can see that every corner only two lines at the max two lines are meeting like here two lines are meeting third line is this direction here also because there is no line from uh, this face that means at max it if there is there can be only two lines here also it will be only two lines meeting here also only two lines because from this face no line is there so it could be one only or it could be two but it cannot be three similar if you see check at these four corners it all corners there only at the max there could be only two lines meeting like here if this line is there there can be another line from that face but here there is no line so that means it can never be three lines at this face similarly for this also and this also and this also so now let's check where if you check each option here we are able to see in this option three lines are meeting so that means it will not be correct here also if you see there are three lines meeting uh, now you have to check between a and c which option is correct and now let us focus on this particular corner if you see there are two lines meeting and the dots are below these lines and there is a third dot on top of this where the lines are meeting here and if you try to find out in these two options we will not find this kind of lines here but here we are clearly seeing this point this particular point here two lines are meeting the dots are below it and and one dot is at the top like similarly here. so a will be wrong and c will be correct so correct answer for this will be c So here we have to find out what is will be in place of question mark. So if we compare these two, we see that this, if this was here, it has come forward. This has was here, it has come forward. But what is happening to the middle space, middle part? This one has come here, and this has gone one step up. So basically, it is moving like this. This is going up, 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 and whatever was in center, it is coming to this place. So it has happened like this. from here to again it will go up everything and this whatever is in center it will come here so again if you see this will move forward and this semi circle will come here on this corner so based on this if you see uh, we are able to see in a and c but b and d are different so b and d will be wrong now if you have to choose between a and c you can see that both are exactly same pattern is there but there again we are seeing here that it is becoming lighter In which like this is dark, then it is lighter. Then it is lighter. Then it is lighter. So basically, the correct answer for this will be C because this is lighter, and this is has same. It is almost similar uh, shade as this one. So correct answer for this will be C. Two views of the same object are shown in the box. Which option depicts the same object? So if you observe here, this uh, this thing which is coming out, this uh, arms, all four arms are in different direction. and even if that is a bit confusing you can see another thing that if it is going up this one then this is going down and then the, again this is going on then this is going down so all are in alternately it is placed like up then down then up then down so if you check that in each option here it looks like correctly placed because this is in this direction this is in opposite direction this is again up direction then down direction if we check in option b this look both are in same direction it both looks like in down and this is opposite direction and if you see this is first one this is second one and third one so first and third here first and third should be in same direction whereas it first and third are in opposite direction so it will be wrong if you see uh, check the option c again firstly you can see that there is a little 
like the, if these both are very uh, closely placed there should be some angle somewhere uh, this should be like on opposite to this like here it is another thing which is very clear these both are down the same direction where it we can say that it's alternately placed so c will be wrong here again these both are in same direction so it will be wrong so a is the correct answer here image shown below is made up of triangles only from which the central portion is missing identify the missing portion so again instead of checking each option for this uh, portion missing portion we'll check among themselves a b c d and check what is different in this like if we see compare we are able seeing that there is a part here this part which is there in all options but it is not there and here we can see that this there is a half triangle so there should be a part here which is missing so c will be wrong again if we compare all this we find that uh, this triangle the part of this triangle is there in a and b but it is missing here so this will be again wrong and again if we see compare a and b what is missing it looks exactly same except this little bit here and here this there is a missing triangle this part is missing so this that means uh, a will be correct and b will be wrong so correct answer for this would be a figure shown below is mirrored along the axis p q r s t and u what would be the resultant figure so to take make it easier let us just mirror this one why i'm taking this one because this is in middle we can see this is equally placed from this one and this one also when we get the final position we can just simply place one on the other one side and another on the other side if i would have taken this one then this is one space one corner part and there are two vertex in between so it might be little bit confusing so if i mirror this one it will be here then this one will be here and then this will be mirrored here and this will be mirrored here so that means if this is the final position of this one the remaining two will be just equally apart like one corner one vertex after that so this will the final position so that means b will be the correct answer and you can check also if i put dots for this also so they can see clearly that uh, if it is mirrored same pattern would have we have got so correct answer for this will be b so we have to find out what will be in place of question mark so to find out that first try to find out what is the pattern in this question figure we can see the squares are there bigger square and smaller square and bigger squares are such place that they are there are two rows of smaller squares and then the bigger squares are moved one step on the right side like this one has started was started from this line then this has started really it has this one also it has started moved one step on the right now if we see in the options we can clearly see here there should be square here there should another square this square should start from here only somewhere so this is wrong b option is wrong we are not able to see the same pattern here in option d also we are not able to see the same pattern because the another after leaving two lines two lines there should be square and this square is on the right side this square should have started the here only so this is also wrong now a and c looks quite similar everything is same except for this corner here we can see white line here there are no white line so let's check which will fit corner this corner will go here and this is a part of a bigger square so that means there should not be any white line so that means c is wrong and a will be correct so correct answer for this will be a an a4 size paper is cut as shown below and folded across the dotted lines such that it has eight faces named from p to w it is further folded to make a small booklet for the purpose of assign design from the given options select the correct sequence of pages so this here there is a cut then it is half folded then again this is folded like this and like this and then this is the booklet so if we can see that if this is t that means it here it will be should be p q r and s and because w is on the top that means at the back here it should be this should be v and back of this w there should be s this one now if we check the sequence p q p q is correct r is also correct but s s is also correct but after s there will be not no t after s there can be w but there cannot be t so this will be wrong this one if we check w s 
W S that is correct. R that is also correct. Then V V will not be correct because V is on the opposite side. So this is again wrong. This one if you check W W S R then Q P T U V then this will be correct. Correct sequence is there. So this is correct. Uh, though we got the answer, let's check this also. W then V. So it is going like this W V U T S. So after T S cannot be there. So again this is wrong. So correct answer here will be C. The left image shows Nandu's study room. The image is sliced into nine equal parts. From the given options, find the correct set of image. So you have to just find out which one is uh, correctly matching with this picture. So again, we will compare them these options among themselves. And if we compare, we can first glance only we can find that this bed sheet has no pattern, whereas every other and here also in original one also there is pattern. So this is uh, not correct. And another thing, if you see, there is a slipper missing. So they, this will option C will not be correct. Now if we see this blue, the book is blue. Where it is uh, sorry the book is uh, brown where it is blue so this is not this should be not correct and again there is a pen missing here there is a pen kept here so this again D will also be not correct now if we check the, between these two options this the headphone she is wearing is brown in color whereas in the original picture it is white in color so that means again A will be wrong so that means B will be the correct answer. In this question, this is 50% of this color. This is again 50% lighter than this color. And if we add these two, we get this. So the question is similarly, if the 50% lighter version of this and 50% lighter version of black is added, what color should be there? So obviously A and B will not be correct because they have another other color where we are adding only blue and black. Between C and D also, C has slight greenish color. So C will not be correct because we are adding only even if it is 50% it is blue and black. It should be somewhere like this. So correct answer for this will be D.